Hello everybody, my name- oh, I bumped the microphone. <laughs> my name is Nilotak, and welcome to the final episode of Spyro the Dragon. I went back and got the last gem. And now we're gonna- we're gonna finish this adventure once and for all by taking Nasty's treasure <laughs> that he's stolen from all of the dragons. We're gonna go take it back. So let's go! Money, money, money. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, and check this out. Okay, look. You see how I'm all alone on the sledge here? Fly! It's a free fly level two, which is awesome. Yeah. Oh, and the music is so fitting. God, I love it. Look at how much. Look at all that. 2,000. Let's go, let's go get 2,000, I guess. This is gonna take a while. I could just take off from any perch. Check this out. Amazing, right? I can just wreak havoc like a real dragon. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Oh. <laughs> Whee! oh man, this is fun. The music is fun. Everything about this is just fun. Oh, there's a... Ah, I'm chasing him like a real dragon. This is cool! This is this is actually really cool. I'm never gonna catch him, though, like this. <laughs> yeah, chase him by foot. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah! Oh, man. Come on, Spyro! You can do it! He has the key! <laughs> oh! You're so close, Spyro! You are oh so very close! Oh, F yourself! Come on. You have to be like right up against the wall in order to catch this guy. This guy is like fast! Check- look at this. Look at this guy. I mean, just look at him go. He's like, I'm an Olympic, <laughs> I'm an, Olymp I'm an Olympic runner. <laughs> I hope that I can finish this in all in one episode. It's kind of a kind of long. It's gonna take a while to get all this, all this treasure. I should be able to get all of it though. Now that I, I know where everything is, so. Mm, I can't get up there just yet. You have to like gain height by unlocking doors and whatnot. I can go up a little higher though, see? I used to not be able to make it up here, but now I can. And I used to not be able to make it up here, but now I can. Roar! It's chasing like an actual dragon. Let's get him! Oh, come on! Yeah! <laughs> Alright, got another key for another door somewhere. Look at all the money. This is a quite a place to put your money, Nork. <laughs> oh, also, I made an interesting uh, discovery. Spyro is as old as me. Remember when I said that Spyro, this game, is almost 20 years old? Well, I'm going to be turning 17 soon. <laughs> and, hello. <laughs> and so, yeah, Spyro, is, this game came out in 1998. I was born in 1998. Spyro and I are the same age, which is amazing. Spyro and I would be the bestest of friends. Oh, I can't get up there. Man! Or maybe I can and I just- Oh, that's right. I have to wait for him to come. Come low. Okay, let's go. Let's get him. Come on! Get him! Yeah! 
I got the key for the door. Dun, dun, dive! And pull up. And drop. And unlock the door. Yeah. I still got ten minutes. I think I can... I think I can do this. Oh. Let's go get him. Ha! Oh, the music. I love the music, guys. I still love it. Like I said, this game aged ah, very, very well. And so is the music. Like, you can kind of tell that it's, it's old. Like, it's like, oh, this is a PS1 game soundtrack, but it still sounds catchy as hell. It's like Crash Bandicoot. God, I haven't heard that soundtrack in years. I'm actually thinking of downloading the first Crash Bandicoot game and playing that for you guys, because I love... I grew up with this, Sonic, Crash Bandicoot, Rayman, and... Lots of other games that I probably shouldn't have played. <laughs> Like Shadow of the Colossus. I played Shadow of the Colossus for the first time when I was like seven. I don't know if I already told this story, but I'm telling it again. I played Shadow of the Colossus for the first time when I was like seven, maybe eight. And it was just a demo. It was just one Colossus, the very first Colossus, Valus, over and over and over again. But I kept on replaying it because I was just like, this game is the most epic thing ever. And I was seven when I realized this. I didn't even know what epic meant <laughs> but you know I, I felt astounded by this by the game and one and one day my grand I'm, I'm playing the game at my granddad's house because he he owned the demo and then he uh, came into the room one day and gave me the full game <laughs> and I flipped out I was like oh my god thank you this is amazing and Ever since then, uh, Shadow of the Colossus has been my favorite game of all time. With Avion, the pterodactyl looking colossus, being the fifth one, being my favorite colossus out of them all. He just looks so dinosaur like. <laughs> yes, got the key. I mean, plus he could fly, so that's a plus for me. <laughs> Alright, let's get up high. Not like that. <laughs> That's immature. Light this on fire. Whoop. I bet you it's going to blow that up over there. Yep. Let's go get that money. Dun, 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 dun. Let's go find out where this key goes. Oh, hey, I missed a chest over here. Whoops. Come on. There you go. You know what would be cool? Because I have a PlayStation three wireless controller it'd be so cool if like you could control spiral by tilting you know the controller that would just be really really cool in my opinion dun dun come on drop there you go where on earth does this key go where is my super suit <laughs> Just the way I said that made me think of that. Sorry. <laughs> ah! This door! I forgot that there was a door here. <laughs> huh, I know where everything is. Do I? <laughs> Do I really? Okay, this gives me a little bit more height now. Not much. But enough to get up here. And so that would be enough to blow that up. I can I can leave now. And that'll be Guys, that's gonna be the end. There's a whole load of treasure like behind that. That's why I still don't have all of it. But I'm about to go get it, so let's go. Let's be careful not to fly into the portal. Okay. And here it is. Look at that cocky little son of a bitch. Yeah! Yeah! Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. 
Peck. Yes. Nasty Nork. You suck. <laughs> Let's go, guys. We did it. Officially. We, we did it. See what happens now. Spyro the dragon. <laughs> what is with the dragon eggs? Saved all the dragons and recovered. He's got sunglasses. <laughs> Problem. Fired up, Bob, and I'm happy for the dragon world, of course. That's awesome. He's so cute. I'm gonna spend the rest of my dragon days butting heads with nasty Nork and his weird minions. What's a minion? Uh, never mind. You know what they say? For every good battle, you need a good adversary. And I felt that nasty. <laughs> oh, poor sheep. Uh oh. Here we go again. Again. <laughs> yeah. We did it. Oh, and here's the rest of the credits. Oh well, it's the credits again, but in different worlds. Oh my God, guys! I'm like freaking out right now. I'm like, is this real? <laughs> is this the real life? <laughs> oh man, we did it! We actually... 100% we beat Spyro. Wow. Gonna miss this game. Really, I'm gonna miss this game. I only have a few minutes right now to finish recording, so I'm just going to say this. Thank you, uh, all of you who have joined me on this. Thank you to everybody who supported me in doing this, you know. Uh, this game means a lot to me. I love it, and uh, a couple of you liked it. It was... It was a fun adventure. The next the next adventure we're going to go on will be just as good. I promise. It's going to be a bit darker. <laughs> Not as cheerful as this game. But it's going to be just as good. You know, the game I'm going to be playing is very underrated. It's not recognized by a lot of people. It's not very well known. And I feel like it deserves to be well known. So, um, I'm just, I'm gonna play this, I'm gonna play the next game, and we'll see how that goes, and I hope, I hope you guys will like it, because I love the game. I love it so much. And, yeah, I hope you guys are looking forward to it, because I had fun with this game. I probably had a little bit more fun than I thought I would, honestly, recording this. But, yeah, it was the best. <laughs> no sheep were harmed during the creation of this game. Remember, guys, all, a few norks, but no sheep. Not even the one that was thrown into the basket. <laughs> He's used as a basketball. <laughs> if you guys saw that. <laughs> Returning home, and we're back in Artisans. Back where we started. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this adventure. I had the best time ever. Thank you guys so much for joining me on this. It really means a lot to me as like starting off on YouTube with this being my very first playthrough. It means, it means a lot to me, and I hope to have many more adventures with you guys in the future. So, I hope you enjoyed this adventure. I certainly did. I had the best time ever. And I will see you all next time. And we'll go on a new adventure, a new journey. See you guys later. Bye-bye. <laughs>